guys, today we're going to be doing my tango again, my favorite. Okay, so we're going to be, I did it a long time and I thought I'd come back with you again. So let's get started. Today we're doing double digitization. I do, I do most numbers like 72 and 81, big numbers, but you fit a level or you choose a level that fits you and not too hard or not too easy for you. It's just right fit for me. So do what fits you. I'm going to go ahead and touch subtracting tens. Ooh, so I want this right now. So I'm going to teach you how to do this one. So if we're doing this, we're going to find a square that ends with a one. And then you take seven and five. We need something five plus what equals seven. And I know that five plus two equals seven, so I'm gonna to touch on the 20. And that's the answer. Same like that. We need to pick something that ends with a zero. And then you take one of these that you think that'll make the subtraction of 20. This has a three at the end and minus 40, I know that. Now I, this, this doesn't have anything or maybe it does. Okay, so eight, Um. 8 minus, minus something equals one, 1, or 80 minus something equals 10, so I need to figure what that is. So I know 70 is 1 less than 80, and this is taking 1 um, from 80, so I'm going to touch on 70. Like that, touch on 9 and 70 because I'm only taking away the 70 and I'm leaving the nine with the nine. Same like that, 60 and that. And then this one, this one, and this is the only one it can be. 42 ends with the two and then you have to take one from 40 to make it 30. Okay, so I got a doubloons bonus, and I think I have enough money to do that. Buy a wave hopper and put it in the ocean. I need to buy a wave hopper, but a wave hopper is 2,202. So I'm gonna keep going. You mean 20,000? I mean 20,000. Wait. 22,000 it was. Okay, 61, that's another 30. And if you know how to do it, keep going. I'll do some more with you. S 73, that ends with a tree just like this 33. And then I know seven minus four equals, 73 minus 40 equals 33. Now this one, um, I'm going to go ahead and keep doing it. You can do it too, that I teach you. And I'm going to go ahead and um, cut the video and show you the next part. Yay. I finished. Now I got a 25,000. So they're doing dance for me. And I completed the lesson. That makes me feel really special. Now that I have enough to buy a wave hopper, it's increasing. <laughs> <laughs> for no reason. So I'm going to tap on wave, wave hopper. hopper. And put it right there. Find Neumann. Put him on the wave hopper. So I have to find that monster that I need to do. That I need to put on the wave hopper. So I'm going to click on each to, s Ingrid. to see which one is the monster I need to put. No, no, man, whatever. Felix. Renee. Neumann. Wait. Yay! 
Now he's on the wave hopper and I put him. So I think that was the end of the mission. I think I'm gonna get a new monster. If, if I am, I'm gonna show you right now. I think I'll come. Hmm. Find Neumann. Put I think I just have hopper. to take him out and then I'll take that. And where is he anyway? He's back, yay! Okay, I completed a mission. I'm excited, I'm so excited. Now I have a purple gem and I'm gonna drop it in the volcano and get a new monster, it was so exciting! I'm so excited. Charlotte. Wow, she's a girl. Some of the monsters are cold. By a bonfire. I'm sure we need more so so i'm gonna go to puzzles and do this now you already know how to do this so i'm gonna go on i'm still playing that tango but you go ahead and all i've taught you today you learn those subtraction skills um tricks and fun and always if you don't have fun find a funner way to do math because it's really important to learn math and i hope you'll I hope we see each other again. Bye!